and welcome back to Crumbs and Doilies HQ. Now you guys have obviously all seen my sprinkle cupboard and admired it from afar. Um, and sprinkles are super fun, right? But sometimes it's really difficult to get hold of exactly the right colour that you need. And also sometimes some of you are finding it difficult to get hold of sprinkles full stop. So Sally and Nikki are going to show you a really neat hack on how to make your own sprinkles. Over to you guys. <laughs> okay, so this is really, really simple. First, you're gonna need some royal icing and Gemma will put a recipe for that in the description box below. Yeah. Um, and then you just wanna mix it up to whatever color you want your sprinkles to be. We've got seven colors in total because we want them to be rainbow, rainbow sprinkles. Yeah. So we're actually using a number two nozzle. Uh, it's just what we prefer in the bakery, but you can use a bigger, smaller, whatever you like. It's up to you. Yeah. So all we're going to do next is pipe really, really long lines across some grease proof paper. You could do this on the surface if you want to, but grease proof is just a bit easy. It's so tidier. It's tidier. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. So to get a nice straight line when you're piping, all you need to do is lift the nozzle up, as you can see, and keep squeezing with the same amount of pressure all the way till you get to the end, and then just lay it down. Okay. So they are going to need to set for about 20 minutes at room temperature. Lucky for us, we made some earlier. And here they are. So they've completely set now and we just need to break them up basically. So you could just kind of smash them but we want them to be a bit more even. Yeah. So we're going to use a little scalpel or a sharp knife or something. And once you've cut them all up you might find that there's um, some dusty bits in there. So the best thing to do is to just put them all through a sieve and that will just separate the dust from the sprinkles. And that's the other great thing about using the grease proof is that you can easily just pick them all up and tip them into the bowl without scraping around. Yeah. <laughs> and that's it, that's how you can so make sprinkles. So easy. Oh my god, they actually look really cool. Do you like them? Yes. And I love the colours. Oh yeah. Well done guys. Thank you. <laughs> um, so hopefully you enjoyed that and you learnt how to make sprinkles and you can do them in any colour you like, so that's obviously a bonus. Uh, the guys will be back um, every other Tuesday with another Tuesday tip, so make sure you're tuning in for those. And I will be back at the usual time on Thursday, 6.30, for a cupcake recipe, so be there for that as well. Thanks guys, this is awesome. Yeah. I'm going to sprinkle some cupcakes. Okay, right, bye! bye. bye. <laughs>